Hey loves, welcome back to our channel. Mm -mm. Hey, what's up? Yeah, listen. I know we said it's best we don't talk no more, but I gotta get it off my chest about all the shit I've been hearing, babe. I, I thought you was that ride I die. You would never leave my side. <laughs> What's going on? It's Faja. If this is your first time to the channel, welcome. I'm sorry I said welcome back like you have been here before. But you know, I guess I'm just pretty much used to saying it. Um, disclaimer, as usual. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, my Christmas tree is still up. My husband won't let me take it down because my godson still hasn't been here to open his Christmas gifts. But thankfully he is coming over tomorrow. And <laughs> that tree will be down so you won't see it in any more videos. Yay! I could probably totally film somewhere else, but this is like, this is my area right here. As you guys can see, right? With all my stickies and stuff. Um, and pictures. But yeah, I could probably feel some film somewhere else. But I hope the Christmas tree is not bothering you guys. Just think of it as decor. But I had to give that disclaimer. So yeah, let's get into what this video is about. So this video is um, the products that I bought into 2017. I mean 2017, Lord, 2018, guys. I'm in love with 2018 already, if I must say so myself. So I hope you guys are too. But the things that I am bringing or that I brought into 2018 and the things that I will be bringing in 2018, yeah. And when I mean those things, cause you know we left some things in 2017. If you didn't see that video, make sure you go check out my video on what I left in 2017, Ashley, what she left, and Gabby, what she left. Um, but this video is pertaining to what I bought into 2018 and what I will be bringing into 2018. Now, um, ever since I started my log journey, I discovered that I don't really see me being a product junkie. I wasn't one as a loose natural, maybe in the beginning. The only way I could see me um, buying stuff is trying out things f mainly for you guys um, and just being able to give honest reviews of it. So yeah, but uh, this video is talking about what I'm bringing in as far as products. <laughs> okay, that's a preview of it, y'all. Um, so yeah, let's get into it. So of course, if you've been watching my channel, my channel, our channel, my videos, I should say. Um, if you've been watching our videos, you know that I started using this. Guys, yes, I still have this little bit of shampoo left. Um, I only washed my hair three times, so. And I've used a different shampoo each time. Crazy, right? But this was the first shampoo I ever used and first conditioner. I'm bringing this into 2017. I thought it was a cool product and I don't have any problems with it. I'll be using it on my hair anyway. Um, so yeah, I think I told you guys that I like this. It was in my, what month was that? Month two video, I think. My month, my update for month two. But yes, yeah, so I'll be bringing in Shea Moisture, the Jamaican Black Castor Oil Shampoo and Conditioner. Yep, I'll be bringing this in now. Yes, I'm going to finish this shampoo, obviously. Um, I'll probably buy it again, but I'm not going to buy another sh shampoo until I finish my other shampoos. That's just how I operate. I can't be, I cannot be no product junkie, y'all. I really can't. I don't even have, I don't even have a space for that. So, I will be bringing in my Shea Moisture, y'all. Yeah. Another product I will be bringing in is my... Almost like my holy grail since I've been locked. Um, I don't know why I'm saying it's my holy grail. I've only used it twice, but this is what I use to um, retwist my hair, retwist my locks. Um, the aloe vera gel, and I like it. Uh, I keep it refrigerated, so right now it's nice and cold. So I will be bringing this into it. I like it. I like 
it's lightweight i don't get flakiness from it it's natural like it's good for not only your hair it's good for your skin i love this gel so um yeah most of the time when i'm retwisting this is what i'll be using like faithfully i'm gonna use this whole bottle because i'm pretty okay with it like seriously the next products i will be which is pretty much done I used this like the entire year for 2017 while I was loose while while I was a loose natural I was unsure if oh when I first became log if I should be using it but girl I'm I am using this Trader Joe's first of all it's $3.99 okay it's a peppermint shampoo did I tell you it was $3.99 $3.99 is a peppermint shampoo. It feels so good. Okay? Like, and it has great stuff in it, like peppermint, tea tree, like eucalyptus. Like, it, it's bomb. Like, that's why we run out here. Like, I could tell you, me and my husband use this. We run out of this, like, in no time. Besides when we, you know, trying new things. So, I didn't use it since I've become a locked natural, but I will be using it. So, I, I'm not leaving that in 2017. I'm sorry. It had to come to 2018. I need that. Um, so, yeah. I will be bringing it into 2018. Already bought in. Um, my Allocay Naturals products. So, now I have the Naturally Unique Lock Oil. Okay, and I have the lemongrass leave-in conditioner. Okay, and I have the aloe berry styling gel. And lastly, I have the moisturizing. Uh, I have the moisturizing black soap. So that is um, what I am bringing into 2018. I already. Another product that I bought into 2018 and will be using consistently consistently in 2018 is my natural deep conditioner. I forgot to take that out the refrigerator when I took the aloe vera gel, but I still have some left. Um, what I have left though, I'm using on my husband. So yeah, but I'm going to order more. Um, we have a 10% discount code. So make sure y'all use that. It's down below, but I will be using it again. Like I really, really liked it and I like the way my hair felt. So I will be using that. That's in the refrigerator. Cause you guys know it should be refrigerated. Um, what else? There's some things I don't think I have here that I forgot, but one thing I will be using in 2018 for sure is peppermint oil. I love peppermint. Like, I love it in my hair. I love the way it makes it feel. I love the tangle, tingly feeling. And peppermint oil is just a really great oil in general. So, I will be bringing that into 2018. Um, what else is another product that I have not shown that I know I'm going to go and purchase? Um, I think I'm going to try rose water. Like, at first I was like gung-ho about getting rose water. And then when I was like, okay, I'm going to have to order it. I just never ordered it. I don't know why. Um, and then I was just like, whatever. Regular water will work. But I think I do want to try it uh, because that was my initial plan to try it. So I think I'm going to try rose water. So I will be purchasing that. And I'm going to insert pictures so you guys know what the products I will be purchasing looks like. And I do want to try Dr. Bronner's shampoo. I know the one I want to try is a peppermint one. People would like to say it's really, really, really good. And I just want to experience that goodness. Um, so I definitely will be purchasing some of that. I don't know when, but I will. Um, oh, another oil that I didn't show is extra virgin olive oil. I might have ran out of that. But I like to keep that in the house. I always use that. That's my go-to oil. Coconut oil is another oil that I use as well. So I'll be using that in 2018. I think that's pretty much it guys like I really don't plan on being like a product junkie whatsoever again if I try new products you guys will be the first to know and it will be for purposes of me seeing if it really works for locked hair or um, that type of thing other than that simplicity is the best and because with locks you don't need a lot of products 
You don't need to be using a bunch of products and different products and you got to be careful what you put in your hair, period, in general. Um, I am just going to keep it really simple. Um, unless Ashley and Gabby talk me into buying something because, yeah, that's probably what's going to happen. But these are the staples as of right now. Um, or the products that I have. I do have other products, but I won't be using them. The, oh, a conditioner I want to try. I don't want to say I'm going to use it the entire year because I haven't tried it yet. I've only tried it on my husband's hair. And that is the Aussie conditioner. It smells so good. The three minute mir miracle conditioner. I'll insert it here because I don't feel like going to get it. But I do want to try that. So I'm going to try that conditioner. I tried it on my husband's hair. He liked it. I liked it for his hair. Um, so I want to try it for myself, but other than that, like I said, I'm just going to keep it real simple. I don't plan on, I mean, I know eventually I'm going to run out of these shampoos and conditioners, so I'll buy what I know and stick with what I know and what my budget can afford at that time as well. Um, again, I don't plan on being a product junkie. Simplicity is key. Um, I hope you guys are enjoying 14 days of loving our look. I don't know what day this is <laughs> that we are on, but I hope you guys are enjoying it. And if you don't know what love and not uh, 14 days of loving our look, make sure you check the description box. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and don't forget to give it a thumbs up, which is a like. Um, comment because I love you guys. Comment what are you bringing into 2018? Like, let me know. I'm sharing with y'all. Y'all not gonna share with me? So let me know. I can't wait to hear from you guys. If you're not subscribed, subscribe. I mean, come on. How are you gonna keep up with greatness? <laughs> but I love you guys. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.